Hello beautiful people, today we're gonna play with Northern Realms uh, and I prepared a deck with a new card with uh, Princess Ada. Princess Ada, it's a human, cursed aristocrat, deploy devotion, gain immunity. So we don't have this devotion uh, because uh, I found it useless. Uh, obviously, um, for this card it would help, but for the deck definitely not. The devotions deck right now in Northern Realms, they are very difficult to play and I would say it makes absolutely no sense to play into devotion. Um, Okay, at her abilities to the first time a cursed unit enters the battlefield each turn, boosted by its base power. Alright, now let me just walk you through all the cards and let's discuss the uh, strategy. So, we're gonna use Pincer Maneuver just in order to get all of our cards that we need from the Northern Realms. A Curse Crawl, uh, so we prefer obviously to be on uh, Blue Coin in order to uh, get a better drawing. The first card uh, that is important for us is a Siege. Uh, with our uh, machines and we are playing obviously here to Onagers since uh, for only 5 points of provision this is a very good card and very efficient and uh, we play lots of machines here in this deck. Uh, secondly, also super important card for us, uh, it's King Demavon and these are two ways to play this card so you can play it in the regular way so you uh, Try to play King Dem event uh, in the first or the second round for the consistency, and obviously you are getting rid of all the weak cards. So you're getting two inches uh, out of your deck, and you're getting um, uh, one of the siege towers because this is the weakest machines that we uh, weakest machine that we have in our deck. And by doing this, you're getting super consistency because you're getting uh, three cards uh, of only four points of provision out of your way. So basically, you play King Demo Vent, then you play Winch, then you play the second Winch, and then the third card you're gonna play is gonna be a Siege Tower. So this is one way to do it, and basically you don't care even if this uh, uh, card will gonna get hit waved or he's gonna get locked. You don't care about uh, about it that much. Because this is our Torres, like a weaker version of Torres, and uh, that's our main goal. But the whole trick about this deck is to uh, be patient. But uh, unfortunately, since uh, I'm playing against so, so much control, uh, it was difficult for me to achieve this. Uh, but I was playing uh, against also Symbiosis, which is a super high tempo deck, and um, it was uh, impossible for me to keep up because I would uh, um, lose the game after two uh, rounds. So. Unfortunately, it depends who are you dealing with, but the better, of course, uh, choice is the second one, because then you would play, firstly, you would play uh, Donimir of Troy as a protection of the whole uh, row. Uh, once you would protect all your row, uh, then you would uh, play uh, Idaran, and then you would play King Demavent, but the first card that you would draw would be Prince, uh, Princess Ada, and then you would play two inches. <clears throat> what it would give you? It would give you uh, a super high tempo in this third round, um, because you would create two uh, Princess Adas, and you can imagine what is going to happen if then you're gonna play a uh, Batchling, and every single turn uh, you will get 5 points of boost for uh, both of these Princess Adas. Well, the concept is amazing, but it's very difficult to achieve this. But once you're gonna, you're gonna do it, believe me, you will be super satisfied and uh, you will get crazy points, because during one round Princess Ada, uh, one of them, can grow up to like over 30 points. So you would, you would get only out of these two cards over 60 points. But um, you need to meet these uh, conditions and um, it's gonna be pretty difficult. Uh, this um, uh, curse scroll, we have it. So we can play uh, Regis uh, Bloodlust uh, in the first round, and uh, we can get, uh, we can create a tempo in this round, so we can we can win it. And secondly, he will not be banished uh, from our deck, uh, and we're gonna keep uh, keep him in the graveyard. Royal Decree also for consistency. So as you can see, this deck is pretty uh, consistency dependent. <coughs> uh, Tony Mir as a protection of Itaran. <coughs> but regarding Itaran, you don't need to worry about it if you cannot use Itaran in uh, in this way that I mentioned before, because Itaran it's also efficient 
uh, when we are playing uh, the scenario just make sure that first you're gonna uh, play let me say I don't know Tony Mirror of Troy to give the protection to Idaran and then you will start with the siege <coughs> what it's gonna give you is that first of all you will create not uh, one uh, trebuchet you will create two of them you will not create one battering ram but you will, you will create two of them so it will give you extra extra points and especially battering ram since this, uh, it has an order so it will uh, give a crazy tempo to onagers uh, and that will give you additional um, damages all right um, necromancy is being played uh, obviously into 20 points card which will gonna be in our case one of these cursed knights that will have uh, 20 points in our graveyard uh, regarding this <clears throat> what you have to do once the uh, regis is being played you need to have one of these cursed knights uh, in your hand and tr uh, transform uh, regis into cursed uh, knight so you will prepare your graveyard uh, for uh, necromancy <laughs> all right then we have immortals uh, and obviously it's a combo with the uh, damned uh, sorcerer sorceress. Uh, match link was already discussed so whenever you play cursed uh, Adas, Ada, then you play botch link this is a super uh, combo uh, redanian secret service for consistency and also uh, as a lock removal uh, Omager, always when you play machines, it's uh, it's very good to have them uh, in the deck. Reinforced Ballista, the order is uh, being triggered every single turn, so uh, basically you don't give one point of damage, uh, but you give two points of damage uh, every single time when you have uh, Omager. If you have two Omager, Omagers, then it means that uh, for every order that you're gonna press in each Ballista, you will create additional, <coughs> additional. <clears throat> uh, additional damages so it's gonna be a crazy crazy value uh, the siege masters for consistency and also they have orders so they work uh, in the synergy with onagers winches for kingdom event a uh, cursed knight uh, to of course transform um, uh, regis a pillar this is additional additional purifier and uh, siege towers uh, you know just 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 the machines with with order so as you can see uh, this deck uh, I would say it's uh, pretty original uh, you need to set up which is not easy uh, we don't have uh, locks here and uh, we also don't have it uh, wave obviously if you don't feel like immortals with attempt uh, sorcerers it's a good um, option uh, you can change these two cards into something different because I would say the only cards that they need to be uh, changed uh, change it's, uh, is third ones maybe if you don't feel like Idaran it's an option also change Idaran and these three cards they are like a question mark uh, and they can be changed but this is like a I would say greedy deck on the other hand for, um, for Princess Ada uh, trigger her, her uh, Ability, uh, you need a cursed unit, and if you're gonna type here, uh, you see, uh, you don't have you don't have that many, uh, or maybe cursed. Yeah, let's go. Um, <clears throat> you don't have uh, many options here, guys, and um, I would say you know like um, you can pay, play a package with the Draug and uh, and uh, this Kedvan. Uh, uh, Revenant, but uh, it's going to be a totally, totally different deck because, because it will not fit here uh, in any way. This is a different concept, and as you can see, we don't have that many uh, that many uh, cursed uh, units here. So I would say uh, this is definitely an option. Uh, if you want to change it, just, just change it into something different. But I would say this is a pretty pretty good one. So just give it a try. Uh, this is uh, another option for uh, playing Northern Realms. Uh, just not to play the you know, good old boring uh, rivers uh, and uh, that's pretty much it guys so um, thank you very much for watching thank you for your time and support please like subscribe and comment guys uh, see you in the next video and last announcement guys uh, please go to the nearest shelter and adopt the dog thank you very much guys bye bye
faces, we've no hearts. Ha, ah, this'll make for a fine poison. Officer, I'm a gentleman.
Ein Maschinen gehen. A coat of arms is nothing you choose. Dare not mock mine. Gods, not a moment's pace. War's crux lies in winning. Not in being persistent. Trust equally in heart and mind. She's rather hungry, you see. One who is blind can yet see. Stem Chanterelle or false Chanterelle. What is it I fancy today? Never bend, never kneel. Sacrifice!
What do you need? Negotiation. Officer, I'm a gentleman. Ah, uh, choke the embers. Wind, blow out the flame. Perhaps it would be best if we went out for a bit of air. Only one with no sense would trust the word of a swan. Mother Earth has run to my life. From you it came, to you it returns. Claim victory!
you. Wind whistles, Willow's whip. Who watches the watchers? them. for His Royal Majesty. to create my own
pass on every ten flash. One of us or not.
Prince Fazliva's honor that's at stake here. This is no time to whimper. This is Prince Fazliva's honor that's at stake here. This is no time to whimper. Ask me twice. A bit of air. Don't recognize your old mates. We're the Crinfrid Reavers. You stand before His Royal Majesty. Crinfrid Reavers! Shit, I knew it! I told you so, you idiot!
Ha ha ha!